Uh -huh. Okay, so today we're going to terminate a CAT5E shielded IDC punch down termination jet. We've got the jack itself, RJ45, we've got IDC terminals, we've got a post that we're going to terminate the shield to, we have a stuffer cap that goes on top, and then we have a shield cap that's actually going to take the shield. I've got your common 110 style punch down tool, technician scissors, and I've got a razor blade to actually cut the cable. Okay? So step one is I'm going to take my jack and I'm going to terminate, I'm going to cut this thing about two inches back. Got a pull string, got the PVC jacket. I'm going to trim off both. What I'm left with is the foil shield. In this particular case, I've got some cellophane shield, I've got the drain wire and then the four twisted pairs. Trim back the cellophane that I don't need. Okay. First thing I'm going to do, I'm going to spread out my, my pairs. And this is a color-coded jack. I'm going to try and keep the twists all the way up into the back of the jack. Okay. Once you've terminated the post according to the color code, you have a stuffer cap. Stuffer cap will slide on and push down. Now I've got to get the shield touching the overall hooded shield for the hood. I've got a terminal post that I can put the shield to. I can simply wrap this around, making sure to keep in contact with the shield. In addition, I'm going to fold the foil shield into the back of the jack to make sure that this makes contact. with the back of the shielded post. And that is terminated.